nice one guys so basically i'm back in the kitchen with another one with chef ricotta cooking show it's amazing to be in the kitchen giving your favorite recipes and ideas so tonight i want to just finish up this salad and remember it's coming up to christmas you know yeah it's, well you can simmer the ceremony really strong um yeah i want to finish up the salad because i promised you guys last night that i will finish up the salad all right yeah so tonight i'm gonna show you um how to sweeten it all right yeah uh, I'm, I'm gonna show you how to sweeten the sorry uh, with a twist this is gonna be um chef ricotta version all right yeah um craig thank you so much man coming on the show uh, please join the membership guys good night good morning good evening good afternoon whatever time at the day big up on yourself my respect goes for you and my love goes for every one of you guys all right here's this him welcome back into the house again big up yourself man every time always a support chef ricotta cooking all right um it's coming up to christmas but we know christmas is far away but we're gonna show you a recipe tonight C. Jackson, good morning. Shanna McMill, thank you so much. Lillian James, delicious, 100%. Miss Jackson, good morning. Eleven, thank you so much. Patricia. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. 100%. All right, guys. Big up yourself. Here's his name. 100%, man. Craig, what's going on with you now? Welcome back into the kitchen with Chef Ricardo cooking. It's coming up to Christmas. I got to give you a recipe, you guys. Now, this recipe is if you are on medication, this is not for you. Okay? I did the video last night without um, medication. Okay, so tonight I'm going to give you a recipe where you guys um, can drink it. All right, here it is. Sorry. So basically, if you watch the first part of the video or I made the sorry last night, this is how the sorry look now. I did not strain it. I could strain it, but I want to show you guys exactly what Chef Ricardo been doing. All right. So this is the way all the sorry steer. All right, lots of ginger, bits and pieces. Now, well, a lot of people doesn't know that when you drink sorry before you go to your bed, it makes you sleep a lot. <laughs> I'm going to tell you the honest truth. If you drink this, if you get a few, say you want to make a sorry tea before you go to your bed, very good for the immune system, very good for sleeping. I will be doing a lot of video on sorry in the week ahead because I want you guys to get some sorry this Christmas. All right. Um, oh boy, I had in some sweet potato for, uh, um, I'm going <laughs> to, this the way I'm doing this way, I know Craig is a different kind of way. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm going to be doing this way, a different kind of recipe, this one from, from, um, from the way I'm going to be sweetening it. If you are on blood pressure, you're taking medication, this not going to be for you. This is going to be for, I will do another recipe a week ahead. Which because I get some more of the siren. So what we're going to do. We're going to strain the siren. Alright. This is the first thing we're going to do. Is run it through a strainer like this one right here. Alright. Um, this is going to be a different kind of recipe. From every kind of recipe. Because siren is a big thing in Jamaica guys. And a lot of, a lot of Caribbean people like siren. But um, everyone do it different, and when it comes to Christmas time of year, a lot of people do their, their bits and pieces when it comes to sorry. Alright, so, but I have a recipe. Someone has shown me the recipe, and I decided to, to, to do the recipe. I want to try it myself. So basically, I'm going to have to run it through another strainer. So I'm going to run it through the next strainer. Alright. 
there is nothing so it's good all right all right there's nothing inside of it so it's pretty good all right now what would you encourage you if you make the sorry like this i would encourage you to take out some for your parents or for your mom or for your dad if you do not want to have certain kind of things to eat all right but the way I'm going to do the sorry, guys, I can also drink it as it is right here. Honestly, look at the sorry. Alright, now, we're going to be using some tonic wine. I don't know if you guys know what is tonic wine. Now, I get the recipe and someone said to me, so Chef Ricardo, I should show my audience this recipe. And that's why I want to do the recipe. If, but as I mentioned before, this is not one of those kind of recipe where... Um... Um... Where you wanna, you wanna, you know what I mean, make for a healthy recipe. If you wanna make the healthy recipe, do not add these kind of ingredients. So we're gonna use some tonic wine. Instead of we use um, red label wine, we are using tonic wine, okay? Now, tonic wine, I never tried before, so I'm gonna do it, give it a go. So we're gonna have roughly about half buckle of, now we're gonna use the whole buckle of tonic wine inside of it. If you don't know what is tonic wine, you can Google it. What is tonic wine? All right, guys. So we'll put some tonic wine inside of it. Then what we're going to do, I'm going to taste it because to be honest with you, I'm not a person who, um, <laughs> I'm not a person who would drink this kind of stuff, but I want to tell you something. I'm going to give it a go. All right, let's taste it. Oh, mm. All right, not bad, guys. It's not bad, to be honest with you. Now, we can also use red label wine inside of it. So we're gonna put some red label wine inside of it also. Little bit of red label wine, all right, inside of it, all right. Um, Jamaican white rum. All right. If you're a good person who's familiar with Jamaican white rum, we're going to put some Jamaican white rum inside of it. All right. We're going to put roughly about one. All right. Two cocks of the Jamaican white rum. Now, the only thing with this drink, all right, guys. I'm not gonna be using sugar. I don't use sugar, so you can use sugar if you like. I will be using some honey to sweeten it, all right? So we're gonna use some honey inside of it. All right, instead of we use brown sugar, we are using honey. Now, this is just a little tweaking recipe which I received and I wanna try something. Let's give it a go again. Wow, guys, I'm telling you. Now, it's a Christmas recipe, Thanksgiving Day recipe. You can give it a go and you can give it a try. Now, you can Google what is tonic wine right here. I'm using tonic wine and Jamaican white rum inside of it, all right? And I use some honey to sweeten it. So you can use, some people use white sugar, some people use brown sugar, but I'm using some organic honey. Let's put a little bit more. All right, then we'll go for another taste and see where we are. Then later on, I will do my bedtime tea, you know what I mean, because yeah. Guys, perfect, guys. Wow. I love it. Now, I never tried before with tonic wine. And someone said to me, said, tonic wine and red label wine, they are similar. Okay? So, that's why I use the tonic wine. So, this person said to me, said, try tonic wine in it. And I give it a try. It's beautiful. I never tried. So, guys, if you make your... um. Your Christmas um Christmas 
sorry drink or you want to do something different this year then you can try the tonic wine inside of it it's beautiful with the tonic wine i get the recipe and i share it with you guys all right so you can google tonic wine i put the tonic wine everything what i use in the title that means you guys can't do any mistake it's beautiful i love it all right very very beautiful drink But as I say, you can drink it the healthy way because the healthy way has got a lot of health benefit. Um, if you just boil it up and drink it, you can use a little bit of honey inside of it. But it is very healthy that way, guys. All right, let's serve it up like this. All right, here it is. Christmas sorry drink, guys. That is amazing. Or you can make it for Thanksgiving Day. Because no matter what happened, guys, I'm telling you this. Every person, wherever you are, you know what I mean? Most Jamaican, them always make this kind of drink a year time. Trust me. People make it every single year. You know what I mean? They wait till Christmas and they make it. Sometimes people make it two times a year. You know what I mean? Three times a year. But sorry drink is popular. But it's also have a lot of benefit without adding all of these kind of ingredients to it. If you drink it on its own, it's very good for a lot of health benefits. It's also very good for weight loss also. So it's a lot of stuff towards it. But I will be doing some more healthy recipes on it and show you some different kind of ticks, techniques where you can also use with it because I got a lot of sari which I can use. All right. And this is the way it look. I use tonic wine, red label wine and rum and some organic honey to sweeten it yep it's just to give it a try guys give it a try and see how it works for you do you only can try all right dm fantastic joy you're like hey what's going on fantastic thank you so much for coming on the show i appreciate it Andrew, thank you so much for coming on the show. We appreciate the love. Clara, blessed evening too. I really appreciate it. Fantastic joy. Thank you so much. Harry Morris, thank you so much for coming on the show, man. Fantastic. Yummy kitchen. Amazing. Thank you so much. Craig, go. Big up yourself. Craig, this one is not for you, you know. <laughs> Craig, go. If you want to make it, you have to take out the healthy bit and then mix it for someone else to try it. All right? Because you got red label wine in it, you got a lot of stuff in it, and those, you know what I mean, I want to encourage you guys, you know what I mean? Um, Andrew Martina, thank you. Thank you so much, man. CC, good morning, good afternoon. Hi, Morris. Um, yes, Craig, this one, you can drink it this way. Jet bread. Oh, your, your mom is watching. All right, tell your mom hi for man. Tell big up ourselves. Chef Ricardo said that. Big up my TikTok and my Facebook audience. Thank you so much, guys, for coming on the show. We appreciate the love. Um, the recipe is a very unique recipe. All right? Yeah, man. It's a brand new recipe from Chef Ricardo, which I would encourage you guys to give this one a try if you can yeah jet run oh jackie oh c jackson thank you so much for coming on the show yeah this is a brand new recipe jet brown yes thank you so much all right guys thank you so much for coming on the show this evening we're not gonna keep it too long i just give you a quick update on the sour drink how to sweeten it and do it a healthy way or whatever you want to do it it's up to you so have a lovely weekend the weekend is finished today is sunday yeah y'all over now where do you find sorry okay if you are in london it's it's piling up in the local shop guys it's like lots of sorry in the local shop local supermarket you can get it um yeah but sorry is right all over the whole place right now 
Thank you so much, Ears is in. Thank you so much, man. Yes, guys, this is the way it look. All right. Rich and nice. Flavor and the texture is amazing. 100%. But thank you so much and uh, with Fantastic Kitchen, thank you so much, Jai. Have a beautiful day and I will be seeing you guys with more recipe. I have to close the show, all right? Looks beautiful. Thank you so much. Have a beautiful evening and I'll see you next time.